Chef Anthony here making some amazing guacamole for you guys. I have some avocados, I have some tomatoes, I have all the nines. I'm gonna dice it up, make some amazing treat for you. First off, let's talk about the start of the show, the avocados. Look at this, preserved in the water. So if guys, if you haven't seen this video, tune into this one, it's awesome. We're gonna uh, slice these guys, just like this with our knife. And this really helps us get the dice on them so we don't have to do as much work on the board. The next one. So I like to start with the uh, cilantro. I know that's a little out of order for a lot of people, but you'll see. I'll start with the cilantro. We'll chop it up, we'll put it in our bowl. Then all the ingredients we chop will really have that whole cilantro effect. So already washed and rinsed. We're gonna actually take it, press it down and roll it. So it kind of comes together and this is almost like a little bit of a chiffonade, but it really helps control this and doesn't make it too much of a mess, okay? All right, remove that. And now we're just gonna take our hand like this and just do the rock method. So we just rock it and it really chops the cilantro without really adding all that force. We don't wanna pulverize it because it'll turn brown. We wanna have it nice and fluffy and chopped. And I could do this all day. Bottom of the bowl, in there. All right, that's two bunches. One red onion here, we're gonna cut this in half. We're gonna actually slice this again so we get a nice piece. And then we're just gonna go like this and get a nice little dice on here. We don't need this too fine. We wanna have like a nice little bit of a chunky little guacamole effect. You know, not too fine, not too pasty. This is easy. Here's my, this is, in, this is in my own head that this works, but look at all the cilantro that I just picked up cutting this onion. So I'm wasting zero today. Half an onion works. Actually, I'm gonna cut the whole thing. I like a little onion in mine, onion. Next is gonna be the jalapeno. So gauge your heat crew. I like two of them in mine. If you don't, if you don't like it a little bit spicy, use a half. But again, same thing, knife effect sliced right down and this is where all the heat is everyone the uh, white part that pith everybody thinks it's the seeds it's not it's right here so i just take my knife tip my knife cut that out peel it out a little bit of water get that rest of that out and like i said if you just want a little bit of the heat use half you know use a quarter of it one thing you could always put it in but you can't take it out that's my motto with a lot of this stuff. So this we're just going to slice right down, then go across the grain right here. Nice quick chop. Next, vine ripened tomatoes washed. We're going to take those. We're going to put them down like this, snap the top off, put nice slices. I probably get about four out of one tomato. Then I'll third it and now I'll dice it again. Look how nice that looks. Once again, you could spin this or you know, chop this stuff really fine, but I don't find a need for it. I think it works just the way it is, just like this. Three cloves of garlic, press them down. Let's get that. And now we're gonna get a nice chop on these guys. Avocados down, just like that. Make sure we mash those right in here, bust these up a little bit. Okay, so I'll say one whole avocado and a half of the Haas avocado. If you wanna double it down, use them both or three small avocados. Now I'll just use the back of this spoon just to get them all mixed. I like to do that before I add the oil, the salt, pepper, the lime, just to make sure we get all of these raw flavors together, kind of mingled. We're gonna do a little bit of lime. I got two fresh limes. So just give this a quick roll. Releases the oils, helps it juice a little better. Go straight down. There's all the juicers, there's all those, but here's a cool, I just like to go like this, make a little X. Like that, these juice so much better. 
so I don't have to, you know, use all my strength, use all my superpowers. All right, that's half. This is whole. We're using two limes, okay? These are only medium limes. All right, two limes in. Quarter teaspoon black pepper. Two teaspoons salt. One ounce, two ounce, three ounce, four ounce oil. You like how I did that? Here's the thing I always tell everyone. It's never gonna taste the same. Some tomatoes are riper, some avocados are sweeter. Always check consistency. That's why I keep a bowl of nachos right here. <laughs> Just to check the consistency. That's what I'm doing right now. This is quality control. Mm. Mm. Quality control, gotta check it again, okay? Salty, cream with the avocado, tomato is sweet. Red onion brings it all in. Mm. I've had some fun with this, but there ain't nothing cooler than some fresh guac. Crew, I hope you enjoy this. Everyone, make some guacamole, use your knife skills, cut some fresh limes, and enjoy.